Hey everyone, my name is Vinay. I'm with Round Trip, and we are driving better health through patient transportation. This is a really big market that we're addressing. Nationally, 30%, that's one in three patients, uh, needs help getting to the doctor and doesn't have a ride. And in fact, 20%, that's one in every five patients, actually misses their medical appointment due to a transportation barrier. And the cost of the system is enormous. If you look at the cost just due to patient no-shows, it accounts to a staggering $65 billion market. This is why we created the first of its kind digital transportation marketplace. So essentially what we're doing is allowing any type of healthcare provider, whether that's a hospital, a health system, or a health plan, to access the full suite of non-emergency medical transportation. Anything from a ride share all the way up to a non-emergency ambulance, all of that can be done through round trip. Really what we're doing is unifying a disjointed transport system in which any ride request can be channeled so that any patient can receive the right vehicle at the right time. You may be thinking to yourselves at this point, why can't Rideshare do this on their own? And that's a good question. And the answer is that while the Ubers and Lyfts of the world replace calls to cab companies, what Roundtrip does is that and much more, including calls to a hospital's preferred transportation provider, calls to Medicaid brokers, and much more. So really, Rideshare, while it's a critical piece to the puzzle, it only scratches the surface of what's necessary in healthcare to make an impact. In fact, Lyft has been the ideal partner for us to expand access and provide on-demand curb-to-curb service for those populations who can access rideshare. So what we've done is, through a focus on care coordination and patient engagement, we've driven some amazing results. We've created a marketplace and a community where we have over 250 active transportation agencies with many more on the way. We've provided up to a 40% cost reduction uh, in d for direct transportation costs through utilizing Lyft and our empowered community partners. And where we're headed is really exciting. We're harnessing the power of a captive audience where the patient is in the vehicle for an average of 20 minutes, and we're using that time to inform, engage, and empower patients about their own health care. Oh yeah, and remember that 20% no-show rate? We've reduced that to less than 4% across all our partnerships. That's five times better than the national average and twice as good as any of our competitors. In fact, the latest uh, measurement in 2019 has been at 2.7%. So we're really leading the space in this regard. So the way that our business model works is that we charge a monthly subscription fee to the organization and passing through all the direct transportation costs to the appropriate payer, whether that's the hospital itself, the insurance plan, or the patient. And the growth that we've seen is really exponential. We completed 10 times the number of rides in 2018 as we did in 2017. And in the first 20 days of 2019, we surpassed all the trips that we did in 2017 alone. Even our revenue numbers are really surging as we've hit and far exceeded the 1.6 million annual recurring revenue mark. And we're serving some of the strongest brands in healthcare, whether it's Geisinger, Nemours, Johns Hopkins, MD Anderson, and the list goes on. We've really hit on some key pain points in healthcare transportation, and we're proud to be working with organizations to really deliver an impact. And no nothing I can say will uh, really amount to what the leadership team has done to drive the success. So our co-founders actually come from some of the largest ambulance companies, not just in the country, but around the world. And with this expertise in medical transportation, with over 50 years of combined experience, we're really uniquely poised to address this problem and make an impact. And with that, I have ver something very special to share with all of you today. So uh, if I ha can get a little drum roll, that would be great. We were officially launched with one of our first uh, partners in Florida, Brooks Rehabilitation, one of the largest and the leading uh, rehab network in the state. Oh, thank you for that. <laughs> Um, and we're excited to continue this growth and really deliver uh, more partnerships and really scale within this market. And with that, um, at this point, I normally would be asking for money, but we actually completed our Series A raise earlier this month. Instead, what we do ask for is connections to strategic partners, uh, access to hospital executives and leadership teams, and really any organization that sees the value in reducing transportation as a barrier and sees the value in the data that we're collecting all across the way. So if you see, uh, if you'd like to learn more about Roundtrip, uh, please come find us at our booth. And thank you so much for your time.